welcome to Pick Your Poison. Today's topic is potassium, and Gwen Stefani was right. That sh is bananas. B A N A N A death. Potassium is a highly reactive, silvery white, odorless metal that shows up pretty much everywhere. It's in fruits, seawater, various minerals, and every living animal on Earth. In fact, you have about 120 grams of it in your body right now. But don't get all, oh no, the killer is calling from inside my body just yet. Let's first talk about what potassium does. For each muscle movement, a sodium potassium channel is at work. Think of your muscles as being like a nightclub. Potassium is a bouncer out front, and as needed, he'll step aside to let sodium in to Dougie its butt off causing your muscles to contract. Too much potassium and the party is over. Muscle weakness, irregular heartbeat, cardiac arrest, and if the dose is high enough, sudden death. Talk about a party foul. So how did you get enough potassium in your system to kill you? Well, it wasn't from an overdose of bananas. You got it in the form of potassium chloride, which you got from the state via lethal injection. You're a bad man, and a jury of your peers decided that you should die. Well, that escalated quickly. Don't get me wrong, Dead Man Walking was a pretty good movie, but still, I take my chances with a different poison. If you'd like to hear more about potassium poisoning, click here. If you'd like to give mercury poisoning a try, click here. You mad hatter, you. And as always, please subscribe for more death ventures and please leave any poisons you'd like to know about in the comments.